34% of 23. So the first step is we need to turn this percentage into a decimal. And 6a, b, c and d, the questions there, will help you with that. So we've got 34% just equals 34 divided by 100, which we have 34. And then we move the decimal points once, twice, to go in here. So 34% as a decimal was 0.34. So that's always our first step, is we turn it into a decimal, which you can get quick enough that you just go, that's 0.34. Now, we have 0.34 is our percentage. Now the word of just means times. And then 23. So 0.34 times 23 is 34% of 23. And we can just work that out. And we will remember that we can just treat this as 34. But our final answer, we have to move our decimal point. So if we had 34, so the decimal point would be here at the end. But we've got to move it twice for our final answer. Let's slide up a little bit. We use a multiplication grid, 30 and 4, 20 and 3, and then we just do what we've done in the past. So 3 times 2 is 6, and we've got two zeros. 2 times 4 is 8, with an extra zero. 3 times 3 is 9, with a zero. And 3 times 4 is 12. We then need to add it up. So you've got 600, you've got 80, 90 and 12 with our equals and we add these up so all the zeros and two is just two eight plus nine is 17 plus our extra one is 18 and then we've got six plus one is seven so we've got 782 but we move our decimal point twice goes in the center there so 34 percent of 23 is just seven Point eight two. So it's all down to basically turn it into percentage, uh, turn the percentage into a decimal, and then the word of means times. So 0.34 times 23, and we work it out, and then that's 34% of 23.